noise just heard is your indoor fan motor. The blower motor just kicked on. Dylan took the amp reading on that. Most major issues we can catch before it does come into an emergency. So what do we have left here? Let's check. We need to blow out this condensate. Blow out the condensate and let's check the temp rise. Blowing compressed nitrogen through there, um, it'll shoot any debris that may collect in that P trap. I've seen it a lot personally. 90 percenters with P traps completely clogged. It, it happens quite often, actually. Alrighty, so we're just about to wrap it up. Do you want to do this inside or do you want to do this right here? Um, well, seeing as there's no holes. Yeah, I can check it right there. Okay. I can check it through the EVAP, so. Every furnace has a temp rise rating, which is, in, they, they give you a high and a low for the temp rise, what it should be. That's also another big check, just to make sure that your ductwork is sized properly. If, if your ductwork is a little undersized, your furnace will run hot. While we're doing this, we'll also check to make sure all the sequences work correctly, sequence of operations.
about 40 degrees. Puts us right there. Between 40 and 70 is what we want. Good to go on the temp rise. We're going to give this furnace a clean bill of health. Um, thanks, folks, and have a nice day.